Be sure to subscribe to our channel. If you're new, turn on notifications and watch the full video. Seven points to hit the board only in game number one. He saw us five games to play. During the EU cast, mm -hmm. what, what were the, who, how many points was first? It was like eight points eight coming points. in from Boyer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how close it is. So, so Pudge is just going to come out and just be like, eh. You guys got like, eight points. I'm yeah. going to get seven <laughs> in game number yeah, one. Yeah, like that's scary. That is scary. That is set the Could tone. you imagine being an NA player watching the EU games and being like, Oh, he kills. Okay, yeah. Right, this is gonna. Oh my God, Poachers got seven. <laughs> what? They're all like, man, this looks really difficult. If they couldn't do it, we couldn't do it. Then Poachers like, guys, step aside. <laughs> okay, how many? You wanted two more. I got you. Everyone, you guys watching? Big bonus times two. There it is. He's toward the circle because they know that if they're rotating late into this, people are going to be built up. People are going to be ready to take shots at them. Look at Blue T's position, just overlooking that that river he's ready to he's, he's like right just we just see it right now he, he's getting ready to take shots at people that are making their way through that are getting fortified in there that are going to be easy targets to pinch with other players because those people are at such a disadvantage here we go excels taking a shot that's armor that he doesn't have going into this next circle right there on your screen myth take a look aspect he was the, the player that won last game took it away from poach like you said, Blue T's just overhead. He's just looking. It's like, come on, guys. Make some moves. I would like some free shots. Try and rotate, please. He sees someone down down low. It is Cowboy Says Bye. Some great names out here. And yeah. NA. And still you have Joseph and J-Storm at three eliminations. Nothing exciting has happened for them since then. But Blue T looking for some more eliminations. Trying to find them. Trying to just get one on the board for the team. I don't think he's going to be able to get it with this elimination. Aspect moving out, rotating elsewhere, so he doesn't just have to take this beating for no reason. So, interesting fact here, that the little yellow diamond that is making their way north side of the circle is actually Legion, a.k.a. Laquan Laquan. You can see the little yellow diamond there north side making that long rotation. He's like, look, I'm not going to run through the river. I'm just going to take my time. going to make mm -hmm. the long rotation. Yeah, try to keep safe. Yeah, and that's that's a it's not a bad way to look at it because when when you see it, he has a free rotation. There's no eyes on him. None of these arrows are are looking in his direction. He's basically free. The only person of contestion was Gorilla on the hill, and then we have Landjock. The big elimination coming My out there. Good. Saw him tried building up. Like it's get. I mean, <laughs> we see a little pattern going on here. People they don't want to fight. They're just gonna take you out. <laughs> if you if you want to build out to me, fine. Like, I, you don't yeah. need to build. I'm coming to you. That's actually a, a little difference we've seen coming from EU to NA. It's just like NA is like, nah, we're going to fight this out now. Let's just do this. Let's have the conclusion happen now. Yeah, here we go, J actually, Storm. That's a good point because yeah. we saw in EU people fought for so long. Yeah. Not here they, in NA. A long time. 30, 40 second fights happening and here we go J Storm making his push into the circle I like that he's taking the opportunity to use these grapplers use what he has available to him to make these rotations happen early on Ooh, almost a mistake there he could have been uh, potentially chipped back a little bit but he's all good to go and we have 46 players remaining still there are many many players without eliminations going into this. And here we have Sen Aspect with two eliminations. He's in a bit of a situation between a few people and is struggling to get his way in here. He has the second place. He did win the last game, if I'm correct. Myth, I'm just getting word. Yeah? Out of the top five standings on the right side of your screen, four of those members are Lucky Llamas. What? <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Wait a minute! Hey! Hey, never mind what's happening on the screen. Wait, hey, Lucky Llama up, baby. Represent. <laughs> Keep it going. <laughs> I figured you'd like that. Woo! There you go. All right, hey, hey listen, that's why I love production. There Plain you go. and simple. There it is. Pass along information. Oh. <laughs> I don't care what's going on anymore. Lucky yeah, Llama. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Lucky Llamas, spam them in the chat. Back to the gameplay, though. God, that made me so happy. Like, I, like, I, I knew that was going to happen anyways. I don't know why I'm so excited. You're right. But, yeah, here we go. J-Storm, <laughs> zero eliminations. Uh, here in a really good situation, though, where he has the match. Horrify is in... Okay. 
weird <laughs> situation where 16 HP, he's in enemy team's build, trying to claim him as his own here. This is really risky. Yeah, and he's he's right up against Risker. Risker with the double barrel, just, just He just waiting. has to edit one wall yeah. and pull the trigger. Oh. Or just coming from up top. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he ticked for five, dude. Oh, he wants it, though, man. Wait, does Risker have the edit? Risker has the edit! Oh. Well, that's why you replace every wall, especially if you invade enemy uh, yeah. builds. You have to replace everything. This is true. And Risker are going to come up big here with a point. Poach sitting here, no shield. Mats are looking okay. He has the mobility that he needs to rotate to this next zone. But I do think that he wants to find an elimination before he does this. Well, here's the thing. What would the Lucky Llamas have him do? Hmm. You're right. Drop more big bonuses. All right, chap. You've got your mission. <laughs> Aspect there you go. Aspect. Also a Lucky Llama. <laughs> okay, four eliminations. Aspect is on top. Uh, he's going to get big bonus, obviously, because Lucky Llama comeback time is, is here and around. Ashton just taking out Blue T from above, and he's above... Um, aspect now, actually, so we'll see if he is aware of his position. If he'll make something happen, and Aspect finds a little bit of blue damage onto his opponent there. He's gonna go ahead and start rotating into this, applying some pressure as he rotates, making sure he's secure from up above. Definitely doesn't want to lose any arm of this rotation. Notices his teammate is that his opponent, sorry, not his teammate, is playing it oh. slow and takes the one on one battle. He knows he's white, he's gonna apply the pressure. Oh, but his opponent definitely has gotten away uh, at this point. There's somebody with overhead. a grappler. I'm telling you, these rotations are tough when there's this many players. There's grapplers, rips, rotations of all <laughs> kind, really, man. Everyone's just rolling out with the grapplers right now. And Wild's actually, I'm pretty sure he was all the way in the back. He used the grappler to, to get himself into the action back there. And oh, here's Jay Storm. Gets. Laser to bit 30 HP. If, if anybody figures out, if anybody else figures out that he's white, he's gonna be in a tough situation. But he is one oh. hit. Oh, and he catches himself wow. just barely. Just okay. barely. Low key stressful. But now here's a here's a difficult situation. <laughs> when you run out of mats, we can't build anymore, and that's uh, what happened. I believe. Okay, so we just saw. Painful go down. Aspect is still alive. Yeah, Aspect. Five eliminations. Find somebody else. But that person got eliminated before he, he could even react to doing anything. Evil. Myth. I believe yeah. I saw Tifu take down Poach. I'm going to just double check to see which of the two is still alive very quickly. Yeah, okay. So Tifu has two eliminations. He took down Poach. Well, that's fine. It's okay. I'll deal with it. Nate but, uh, Hill was lost in the storm. Aspect, my boy. Another Aspect elimination. Still up in here. 60 limbs. He's going for the seventh. This is it. Oh, oh! oh so close. It just misses him. Up. He grapples. Guess somebody else gets the elimination. Or he died in the storm. One of the oh. other aspects struggling to find his way out. Grapples up. No. Has no more grapplers. Was trying to go for another one to get the ultimate high ground. And he's just going to go ahead and tunnel up. Play it slow. Just catch his breath for a little bit before he has to start moving forward. <gasps> and finds it. another player, but misses the no, shotgun shot. The he wall. needs to start moving. He needs to get out of this zone. Oh, he got to stop blocking himself. Oh. An aspect goes down there. That's a tough situation. Man. That's okay, though. Tifu's still alive. Got six players left in the game. Taking a look at the top six right now. Hogman, Tifu, Ashton, Landjock. Gorilla is actually down, so it's now Nikiski. Five players. And we have Tfue holding down the high ground here. 400 mats, 11 rockets at his disposal. And 356 AR bullets. Tfue is mm -hmm. sitting pretty right now. Yeah, and it looks like this is actually going to go back. It, it seems like the zone is going back toward all the builds that already, that already took place. So yeah, he's going to be able to in. catch some. He might be able to catch some materials through that. He might be able to get some more ammunition, more rockets, whatever it really may be. He could probably catch some more of it and catch people on these rotations. 
There you go. Picks up another elimination. Another That's number four. A med kit found up top as well. He's going to pop one so he could just go ahead and get full HP before getting the late game. Does hear some grappling going on. So he's going to take the time to slow down and just stop whoever is applying that pressure with the grappler. He's just playing super patiently. He didn't, he didn't do anything crazy. He didn't overbuild. He built a wall, a ramp, one rocket, and then he resets. And then, he, look, he's just going right back to healing. This is classic Tifu. Very slow, patient gameplay. Landjock's down below with a double barrel. Nikiski also ultimate low uh, ground here. Yeah. And now it's just time for Tifu to just rain it. Just let him have it. And you hear it. It's happening. Caught it some bills there. Landjock closing in. Down oh, below. No. From underneath. <gasps> oh boy. Oh. Nice. Great catch go. himself. It's Landjock versus Tifu. Tifu lands a rocket. They're fighting. It's a 1v1 situation here. I think they both. Oh no, Tfue is has one more wall, but <laughs> it was lost Landjock in the storm. the storm. And hits him with the OG dance, the ultimate disrespect coming out. Taking the hard trade when they can, not taking the hard trade when they can't, and that's all the science behind it. They're playing for they playing when they can't, not playing when they when they when they can't play. So they're playing when they can, not playing when they can't. Yeah. And that's not what we saw coming out of EU, right? EU, we saw yeah, longer and, engagements. Yeah, and EU, we seen longer dance. Yeah, yeah, we've seen these engagements where even when the player shouldn't or can't, they would, and that would lead to that extended, uh, that extended battle. And then on top of that, it works the other way. When there's a player that can play the aggression, they don't play the aggression, mm -hmm. which I found that to be interesting. Like somebody would have 200 HP and they're kind of you know taking it easy, but in NA, you know, if you have 200 HP in a double barrel. You're, You're in. Full send. You're going <laughs> in.